How's it going city builders? I am Jake, your resident architect, and welcome back to Cities by Jake. And today we're going to be doing part two of this new town on the outskirts of our city. So last episode, we went ahead and made the city center along with adding a train station. And then we did a bunch of um, neighborhoods that kind of fall in these little pocket neighborhoods and stuff. So what we're gonna do today is we're gonna get onto the other side of the highway and we're gonna do some more pocket neighborhoods along with, you know, maybe a school of elementary school, maybe a high school as well. And we'll do some more pocket neighborhoods and then we'll also probably do some farming, just get some farm fields in here and then maybe some forestry fields as well. But before we get started, if you like City Skylines too, please give this video a like and if you're new here, make sure you subscribe to the channel and ring that bell icon to be notified when a new episode comes out. Lastly, drop a comment on what type of videos that I should make. I've been getting a lot of interesting comments on what I should do, and I'm curious on what you would like to see me doing in the channel moving forward. All right, welcome to Magnolia. So like I said in the intro, we're going to be focusing on this area today along with down here. And then once we finish up this, this side of everything, we will go ahead and detail everything out with developer mode and all of that. I don't think this is this area will be done today. Um, given that we added this road, I'll probably throw maybe you want to eventually come back and detail this out, but I do as i was building out last week's episode um i've kind of come to the conclusion that i want to get as much as i can basically as much as my computer will allow me to develop and if this entire map is developed in some shape or form whether it's just trees or like you know nature reserves like this would be really cool if this was like a nature reserve that you can kind of walk through or there's just some pocket homes in here I'm really cool anything with here just some like pocket homes I think whatever I'm gonna do today is we're gonna raise this up a little bit more to make it more prominent but I want to at least develop out this entire um, border like with a bunch of stuff with a lot of detail I don't know if my computer will allow it, but who knows? I have noticed that we are dealing with a lot of garbage pile up, especially down in here. So we um, might need to put like a some sort of landfill over through here today as well. So before, you know what, so we already laid out the roads for this, so we can probably go ahead and just get zoning right away. What I'm going to do, I'm going to zone out this neighborhood, this neighborhood, this neighborhood, and over here, see what we got, see what we're working with really. And then we'll figure out where we're going to put our farms and all of the schooling and stuff like that. Let's go ahead and do that. All right, so those homes are built. We got a neighborhood right here, here, and here. I also went ahead and terraformed this up a lot so that we're not 
tempted to zone here and um it looks a lot better i gotta cl i gotta clean it up all along with this edge anyways so but so that's that and i'm thinking about doing a farm here and a farm here and then i want to double check terrain might be able to get more oh okay um, i said i was going to do forestry here we might be able to do a farm just get some farm over through here as well dense up some trees here dense it up around here i'll just do farm right here so i think that's what i'm going to do i'm going to focus on these big plots of land to be farmland so we'll grab our small road dirt road and let's get the contour line double check We're relatively flat but what we do is we'll do that and what i want to do is let's before we do that let's grab this let's do a little livestock farm here that Let's actually switch this to the other side. So let's do rain farming here. What we actually have to do pause here. Then we need to. We have fertile land over here. Right now we don't. Do that. Then we have our grain farm here. We can then We have that as a grain farm here and then let's grab livestock the livestock farm back here like that let's grab a single family So we have that, so that's two farms right here. And then we'll have to do the same thing right here. I think I'm gonna have it enter from here. Let's grab our road. And what we'll do, let's do something like that. go into our specialized industry let's do vegetable farming let's do textile
Okay, so we have our two farms right there. Go into our low density. And two. One home. Okay. Let those build out. I do want to grab and um brush in a bunch of trees right here. Really hide a boundary line. do some detailing wrong here but I get a bunch of trees in here okay so we have a bunch of trees in here and I think I might end up um, fix this road and we'll loop it through here and I don't know what I'm gonna have down here maybe uh, no because the air pollution Go strong that way. So can't have any any industrial here. I think I might end up just doing a lot more homes through here. Do another neighborhood, maybe. Draw a bunch of roads through here. Just pop some neighborhoods. I don't know. Let's. Put a hold on that for now, just so we can kind of see what the um, pollution is looking like. So I want to focus on this area. I think what we're going to do is let's grab commercial. Do some commercial along here. Then let's grab an office right here. And let's do another commercial. Get that going right here. We have good fire coverage, good police coverage, healthcare. Should have a, let's do a medical clinic off of this road, grab an alley road. Actually plan this. And then we'll grab not what I wanted to do. Here. And then we'll probably need to add a least uh, crematorium. So, may actually, maybe. Go to here. What if we did a large cemetery here? So 
but what if let's crash this for a second let's come here that then what if we grab do a road right there And then we can do another farm, but then over here we can do cemeteries. Let's place one to see what it does with terraforming. Okay, so we're only gonna do one cemetery and then we'll do a couple of crematoriums. If I were to... Really, let's have this. here alleyway let's do something like this where we then grab our cemetery it right there let's put church right here we have the tomb right there let's put that right next to it Then what we can do is let's drag that road right here and then we'll grab, oh, nope, crematorium, but right there. Visual incinerator. Couple extra hearses. Then oh, let's just stretch that road right there. Let's clean this up. Okay. We have a cemetery for that. That was probably needed, honestly. Just so we can have a lot of cemeteries flowing through here so that they don't have to come from over here. And a lot of, looks like we might be going through a death wave. 
I think we can... Add some homes through here. Uh, actually, second thought. Maybe we'll just leave it like that. Okay, so next we can move on to our elementary school, which is going to be right here. Right now, we're only struggling with elementary school and we're struggling with college as well, but that can, we can wait for that. I want to get an elementary school over through here. I want to draw alleyway road right here. grab this and let's just upgrade that and if we need to we can expand to grab an another one but i just wanted to add an elementary school here so that now we should be good that should help with everything over through here and add our districts okay so the last thing that i want to do is i want to fix this area out before we get into our detailing portion of the episode, which we have a lot to detail. All of this area and all of this area as well. I want to create a telecommunications you know, server farm. I'll add, you know, try and get three buildings in here so that will really boost up this whole area. We're gonna have our entrance through here. We're gonna have a small alleyway road that kind of comes along through here. So what I want to do, let's grab our um, level tool. Then we'll grab this level. Level out full area. And I do want to slope this up. That, and then let's grab our alleyway. And turn anarchy off just in case. Let's just continue. Out our leveling tool. Then I want to just level everything to this area. that's what they would do in real life
grab that. Let's get the buildings down first. Trying to get three buildings in here and then a place where we can power everything as well. We want to have some transformers in through here. Then we can do an emergency battery station in here as well. Okay, so this is going to be the general layout. We'll just have to kind of get the roads to work. We'll do some substations over here. We'll have our battery station right here and our three server room areas. How did this do? So this really pushed it here and it didn't really do much for back here. We are going to have to extend it. We'll probably put one like up here be another one over here as well. But if we were to grab a two lane road, here, that then relocate this here or actually push this back to here let's grab parking lot medium parking parking then we can grab a pedestrian path. Do here. That's that. Then we are going to do the same thing for here. Two medium parking lots, locate okay, this. Edge, locate okay, this. There. Then we'll grab our walking path. 
here. Push back right there. And uh, let grab. Inner key that parking and do. Then let's go back to our alleyway roads and do this one. We will actually wrap around because we're going to have transformers or AKA substations and through here leave that right there and I honestly think I can just replace of an alleyway might as well just do a regular road fit it on here that then we can push just push this back Add. Then we can grab an alleyway road, turn anarchy off. do is just all around So we have a um, data center campus, a quick one. We'll have to connect these to the actual grid, all of that. But we have we actually have plenty of room to potentially expand. Um, either battery backup or over here, more substation. We wouldn't expand a substation anyways but you could potentially expand to another building over here just fill it in a little bit more and we can add a fourth building over here and then we add a fifth building right here so let's just connect those up okay so those are connected up nice I'll have to obviously clean that up clean this up but i think that's probably where we'll push it into this episode okay so we're gonna get into the detailing portion of this episode where we're just gonna go ahead and do heavy details down in here probably won't do much detail in through the actual neighborhoods but we're gonna add a park here um, I might add some park paths kind of along the edge of this road, connect stuff. Then we'll probably do some like docks and stuff over through here. And uh, I think I'll probably add another telecom telecommunications here. But then yeah, do a lot of parks and stuff 
Nothing too crazy. Yeah, so I'm gonna do that and be right back. Start it up. So I went ahead and detailed all of this out. Um, looks a lot better. Like I said, I wanted to just want to get a few docks in here. Um, detailed out mainly the city center. Didn't really do too much back here just because I feel like it didn't really need it. I did add a like, I guess you would probably call it a scenic lookout. Um, park and ride just to kind of park just check out the sites you know you kind of have like this nice little view here of everything there's a lot of higher end signs over there <laughs> a lot of higher end yeah a lot of higher end signs over here um and then yeah so i went ahead and detailed out all of this area added a garbage facility here hopefully that will help this area out. Um, then just mainly just added trees here to really densify everything up in here. 
But I'm really liking how this turned out. Maybe in the future we can do some nature reserves in through here and in here to add a little bit more detail to this area. But for now, I think we're going to leave this as is and we can move on to um over here. I think that's this is the area that we're gonna tackle next. I don't know what I'm going to do with this area, but I do have an idea for this area. Um, but yeah, so I think that's where we're going to call it today. Um, yeah, this is, definitely, this is definitely a great um, small town vibe. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give this video a like. And if you haven't done so already, make sure you subscribe to the channel. And ring that bell icon to be notified when a new episode comes out. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.